Hi all, welcome to this Dijon Fever 21 team prediction video. This one's not going to waste too much time simply because there's not much to really work with and this one is actually fairly straightforward. For the simple reason that most players in this team will likely stay the same with minor upgrades for a few players I'm afraid. It is literally in a nutshell simply due to how the team performed last season and also looking at squad for FIFA 21 at the moment from a confirmed FIFA view is not too much but obviously it may improve in subs and reserves in due course but if we could special like so it would be awesome sub to channel if you know if you want to the legend all links down below for posting the channel and social media links as always and comment down below who you think will get an upgrade downgrade and so forth from John. Starting off with Gomis up one, potential to go up more, one of the bright spots of Dijon season got an inform, deserved actually even a couple in all honesty, but is what it is, Otoa staying as he is, nothing justifies an upgrade or a downgrade, same for Akula Manga, I was hoping he might have done enough to sneak to a gold, the ex Cardiff defender, so commonly expensive in SPCs, I can never get ahead for him. Chaffick, nothing justifying an upgrade there. Diop's a funny one because as far as I believe he's joined back from Celta. There's nothing really convincing me that there's an upgrade but he could at the same time if they decide to... Um, but that's the same with Fakula Manga. If it's only if they really wanted to I feel. Didier and Dong, uh, up one, just minor upgrades really. Um, nothing else other than that. And we Fatano staying as he is I'm afraid, 74 raid, not enough to justify an upgrade. Then Benzia, um, downgrade of 1, just injuries and game time for him is the big reasoning. Uh, Samar Tano, if I pronounced that right, um, staying as he is. On to um, Mama Baldi going up to a 75. He this is like a significant upgrade. He actually deserves it. Had a very good season and going up to from 73. And then Julio Tar uh, Julio Tavares, um, another um, impressive player within the team for his season. Um, good number of goals. Where it makes a difference or not to make them justifiable an upgrade i feel it will if it is i feel it will go up too don't expect anything else really on them to go up significantly except for the shooting but you've just got to work with what you have on to the subs and reserve runner since thing as he is nothing justified um upgrade or a downgrade aguerd aguerd even get my pronunciation right Staying as he is 67 rated centre back. On to Kuo Valley, staying as he is. If he remains part of the team, obviously, Marie 71 to mid. And nothing um, justifying an upgrade, but I'm afraid it results in a downgrade going from a 72 to a 71. I'll try and get this name right. Shuar, 60 rated left mid. Um, for me, one of the few players that deserves a significant upgrade going from a 65 to a 68. Um, but that kind of sums up the season performance of the team. And then Alphonse, the right back, staying as he is as a 67 rated. Um, within the team role, um, I know there's like a mix of like bronzes and silver, or maybe potential silvers that could be. Still part of the team for next season. A lot of it was um, because like the contracts expire at the end of the month, so it's like it comes down to the club if they wish to obviously extend those contracts. But I'd say this one for me was a fairly straightforward one. I'm um, of piecing it together, looking at it, but obviously proof will be in the pudding. I'd say two gold most likely. At the very most, expect four, maybe. If I, if at very most you could expect six, but realistically it's probably two or three. If I'm brutally honest, but we'll see what happens in due course. I see this one's not as long compared to others due to the number of players in the team, and the info is fairly straightforward because there's very little um, adjustment. So hopefully you find this useful. Smash the like, so sub to channel for new format, Twitter, Jesus, Legend, and I will catch you all later.